Hello guys and welcome to another log of a Holy Wings BE Memory Dim. And for today's log, we have how do we pronounce this? Ake Angimon. Yeah, I think it's not just Ak Angimon, it's I think it's Akai or Ake Angimon. Yeah, but before I continue with today's log, just have to say if you're a fan of Digimon or raising virtual pets, you've come to the right channel because this channel focuses on raising Digimon and I upload at least twice a week. So if you like such content, Go ahead and shoot the like and subscribe button with Angimon's light and turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. Alright, let's get down to today's vlog. Pidomon has evolved. Pidmon, Pidomon. And I realized I didn't uh, mention the etymology of Pidomon. I think it's apparently short form of Cupid. Yeah, you know Cupid, the Cupid Angel. So it's like Pid instead of calling it Cupidmon. I don't know why I didn't want to call it Cupidmon. But yeah, so this is the evolution of uh, Pidomon, okay, Angimon. And surprisingly, it has gotten an SSR ability at the ultimate evolution stage. So there's been some Twitter posts around saying that maybe the latest BE memory has an increased rate of SSR and UR abilities. So I guess I'm also experiencing that. But anyway, the observations are empirical, empirical and it's not... Um, data mind so we really don't know it's just observations it could be a statistical bias that you're observing as well so uh, statistical anomaly but anyway uh this is the evolution this is the log and <coughs> let's get down to the log itself and its profile a a principality ultimate digimon of equal rank to the likes of magna ingimon and ingimon so Interestingly, if you look carefully at the number of wings, right, remember this is a recurring theme that is brought up in most of the Angimon uh, logs, and we'll talk about it when we have Angimon and Magna Angimon or Holy Angimon uh, in the Digimon Adventure 02. I think Angiwoomon is also in there as well. So there'll be mentions of you know this angel lore in Digimon, and they consistently mention the number of wings relating to their rank so as you can see here they mentioned that it's the same rank as Mena Ingimon if you look carefully at Ake Ingimon you count the number of wings it has one two three four five six seven eight so there's one there's four wings on the right four wings on the left and if you look at Magna Ingimon, Holy Ingimon and Ingiwoomon they both have eight wings as well so in the previous log in Pitmon's uh, Pidomon's log I wrongly mentioned that Ingiwoomon has six wings uh, apparently Angimon has eight wings Angimon does have six wings so those are the ranking system but anyway we'll just keep talking about this as we come along so anyway uh continuing on the profile okay Angimon cares deeply for others and is often interacting with various digimon due to this aspect of his personality he specializes in a defensive fighting style his superlative ingenuity allows it to act as both counselor and commanding officer of his assigned squad oh that's cool on the battlefield, okay, Ingimon typically protects his subordinates, Luxmon and Ingimon. Provides support by issuing direct commands. That's cool. Okay, Ingimon rarely participates in battle itself, but it can use a flaming maelstrom to summon its underlings, Gargolmon and Manticormon. Oh, Manticormon is uh, one of the older uh, Vital Bracelet series Digimon that was featured. Very cool. Uh, beast virus type. Uh, Digimon that looks like a demon but controlled by the angels to uh, destroy demonic type Digimon. So cool. It then controls them with two holy chains wrapped around its arms. In its Saint Legion move, it summons myriad familiars and controls them all at once. It also uses its uh, sacred staff holy rod to incinerate foes with it in the intensified fire of his heaven's flames technique. Lastly, with the supportive move, Brave Aura, Ake Ingimon envelops his allies in flames spewed from its holy rod to protect them from enemy attacks. Very cool, so it's a very flame-based angel. I think consistently there's a lot of mention of flames and in its attack, Heaven's Flame. Very, very cool. And I think it's a continuation of Pidomon also uses flame, if I remember correctly, Holy Flame by Meteors. So yeah, maybe they're like, you know, Ingimon is all light and... Oh, Arcade Angimon line is all using flames mostly. So that's 
cool. Uh, for those who don't know, Arcade Ingemon is featured just for the Vital Bracelet series and it's, I mean the Vital Bracelet BE. So this is the first time it's debuted and I don't think it's appeared in any other uh, in Digimon games yet. So this is the first. It's created just for the BE memory. So liking it, very cool. I think it's super unique. And, and I really like the design, the artwork and a sprite looks great. Can't wait to see it in action on the bracelets. You want the bracelet? Okay. Ingemon. All right, and here we have Arke Ingemon on the bracelet and it's looking cool. This is his walking animation. I love that sprite design. Very, very detailed. Can't wait to see how Holy Ingemon and Marine Ing I mean, uh, Holy Ingemon and uh, Inji Woman look like uh, for those who don't know, Holy Ingemon, Holy Ingemon is the Japanese name for Magna Ingemon. Magna Ingemon is the dark name. But yeah, look at this. This looks amazing. It's a new ultimate level, ultimate class Digimon. And I think it looks great. And let's see his training animation. You saw the sleeping animation just now. Um, strength training. Can't even coordinate well. Looks awesome. Sprite is nice. All right. Also dumbbells, just like Pedomon, cast his rod aside and doing its weightlifting, weight training, strength training. And let's see the dash animation. There we go. Amazing flying animation. Very very nice. All right. Let's see it in action. Battling. Well, I really like the quality of the sprite animation. They're super detailed right now. Like, can you look at the, the level of detail? You can even see the armor. The armor is like, I don't know if I can zoom in a little more. Yeah, look at the armor. Check out the armor detail. Like, seriously, that is some very good design over there. Actually, I should just do my locks at this kind of. Um, because you know, if I just move in, it doesn't it doesn't focus as well. So I have been avoiding. I've been doing it at a distance. But actually, if I just zoom, I think it's okay. All right, okay. But can you see the detail? The armor is like textured. It's not flat. You know, they try to make it a little like there's a dimension to it. It's popping. Look at the waist. You can see. The, the scripture, the Digimon character scripture, the holy scripture that's on its red waistband that's really detailed. I mean you can't see the actual characters but you can tell that there's something going on there. If you look at the artwork, you'll know what it means. Anyway, let's see it in action, battling. Uh, we need that. Let's go. Hey, ho oh, oh, uh, oh Going forward, I should just do this. It's clearer. We capture a little more detail than at the distance that I've been doing consistently so far. Ah, sorry I didn't do this earlier. Alright, uh, still haven't found a battle that's suitable. Let's try again, let's try again. We'll just keep trying till we get one that does well. E yeah, this is okay. Uh, could feature most of the stuff that you want to see. All right, yeah, I like this. This this framing is good. Oh, oh, no! Please let me fire your ultimate shot. I want to capture it. Your holy flame. Very nice. Can you see that? That's its artwork. Boom! Decisive win. Good job. Okay, Angelmon. And yeah, you won that battle. Nicely done. I'm not sure if you met your battle requirements for evolution yet. We could take a look and also it might potentially spoil who we are evolving into. Maybe I'll just check it later, I don't want to spoil it. It's nice to see. Anyway, the next day it will evolve. So looking forward to that. And that's it for today's vlog. If you haven't already, please go ahead and burn the like and subscribe button with Holy Flame from Archangemon. And turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Ooh, I like this. I should have done this long ago. Okay, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.